we weren't even expecting to experience infertility, but doctors had told us that I had a one in 10 chance of us actually conceiving a healthy embryo. Surprisingly, we ended up pregnant the following year without any treatments. At our 20 week ultrasound, we went in for devastating news. There was a myriad of things wrong with our son's development at that point in time. He was born alive and we had five wonderful weeks with him in the primaries NICU. It was a dark, low time for me and I felt like I will never make it out of this. I was asked by a family friend to sit on a panel for people to come and learn about infertility and infant loss. And when we were leaving, the other woman who was there sharing her experience with infertility asked me if I had ever heard of UIRC. And she invited me to look them up and there was a conference coming up that October that I should attend. And ended up going to the conference that year. It was at that conference that I learned about Utah adoption specialists. I I came home, shared it with my husband, and that was when we decided we would adopt. Utah Infertility Resource Center is a place to feel seen. Part of a support group leadership has taught me is that our stories are so profoundly different and yet so much the same. When I was in that fresh state, it was so helpful to me to hear other people say, it's not that it gets better, but you will you will get through this. So it was just such a great place to have every kind of resource you need and the support you need all in one place.